My name is Alison DaCosta. I am a speech language pathologist. I have my certificate of clinical competence. Uh, I'm a member of ASHA, which is the American Speech and Language Hearing Association. Um, certified, I went to uh, Idaho State University to get my master's degree and in the University of Utah to get my undergrad. Um, I have been specializing in, with children with disabilities for many years now. Um, my first job that I had out of grad school was to work at a junior high, and I worked in their EDID unit, which is emotionally disturbed and intellectually disabled. Um, so they were both combined, and so that was a very unique and interesting experience for me, and I got to learn about children who have a really, really, really extra hard time uh, participating in school and learning. Um, I started this clinic. I am the owner of ReTherapy Services. Started this clinic because I just saw a great need um, for families to just get services um, that they weren't getting in our particular area. Um, I am from a very rural area. Um, my hometown is 300 people, and so I, I started to meet people that were not able to get the services that they needed for their children with autism. And I knew that if I could make a difference, that I needed to do it. And so we started the clinic, and we've been at it ever since. So in our clinic, we provide speech and language therapy, occupational therapy, and ABA behavioral therapy. In this course, we will be learning about what speech therapy is, how it can make a difference for you and your family, how it can help your child with autism, um, and the things that you need to know about what it is. Why do children with autism need speech therapy? Speech therapy helps children be able to learn to communicate. Without the ability to communicate, it creates frustration, it makes it really hard to establish relationships, and it makes it really difficult for people to be able to express what they want and what they need. And so speech therapy helps families to be able to accomplish those tasks so that everyone can be able to live life instead of just living autism. So today, I'm going to give you some practical tips and helps to know how you and your family can use speech therapy at home.